The next topic I would like to talk about was not even a question, but I'm just going to bring it up myself. Yeah. And that is health slash stress. Yes, health is important to you. And yes, stress will be there. So how do you deal with it? Um, I'm a guy that was very bad in dealing with stress in the past. I have uh, a track record of anxiety and panic attacks. I have a fear of flying. Uh, so 10 years ago, I was not really good at managing that. As you get older, you start seeing things that are more important in life. And um, I started to pick up yoga at a certain point. I started really taking notice of what I'm eating. So I eat a lot of fruit, I eat a lot of vegetables, I drink an awful lot of water. Um, and um, um, the breathing exercises really, really help me. Um, I usually do this like early in the morning before I start. And um, it really helps me to ground myself and uh, relax myself. Another thing that I do is that um, before I go to work, I plan for myself roughly how the day is going to go. So, um, and when I do that, I take notice of the fact that things might not go quite the way that I want. So I always plan for the worst. And then at the end of the day, I'm saying to myself, well, that was actually not that bad. And it feels like a relief. Um, another thing that I do is before I go uh, to bed, before I retire and do something relaxing, I always look at my calendar and look at what my next day roughly is going to look like. And I try to picture in my mind roughly what that is. And it's like, okay, I got it under control. And then I just um, stop worrying about it. And then the next morning, I plan the day, how it could potentially play out at its worst. But it never does it. So it always feels like a relief at the end of the day. And yes, there will be a lot of things that will be hiccups. Um, things might not work out the way that you want it to work out. Um, um, your, your music is being turned down, uh, scenes are not working, the movie's being cut around and you have to keep up with your, uh, with your music. Yes, it can be very stressful. Um, but what, what it's a thought that always sticks on my mind is like there's always that date that will be judgment day and it's the end. You know, it will stop right there. So if I work on a specific movie and I know that the deadline is going to be, let's say, March 21st and it's now February 10th, I know it will be over in roughly 25 days. So um, that is always like the light of the, of, the, of the tunnel. Now the problem is that movies will overlap. Some movie will slightly run longer. Another movie might start a little earlier. So there's always like a little bit of overlapping. And those are the periods that are uh, the most stressful because you're finishing one while you actually should be completely focusing on the second movie. Uh, but this is normal. This happens to everybody. Everybody is aware of it. Um, and sometimes talking to your colleagues really helps. So um, in that respect, um, I've had so much support from Hans Zimmer. Not only that, uh, I was um, uh, fortunate uh, to work with him, work for him, but also develop a career um, under him and then outside of him. And we always talk together. He always gives me advice. He, he always says like, um, yeah, but Tom, it's going to work out. And just take notice of this and take notice of that. And he's always been very warm and very fatherly uh, to me where, uh, about the things that I should be taking care of. And um, these are very important advices that I that I got from all these uh, people. It's, your health is very important and this, this job takes definitely a big toll on you. Um, working days are of 16 hours a day is very normal every day, including the Saturdays and the Sundays for months and months on end before you have a break. So you have to be healthy, you have to be fit, you have to eat a lot of really healthy stuff um, and that will guard you uh, for potential, uh, potential uh, mayhem. So that's how it works with health and this job. I hope that answers that.